How's it going everyone? Sinister here, back with another video. Hope you're all enjoying the content and things like that. If you enjoyed this video, hey, be sure to hit that like button and hit the bell for notifications. So, so now, uh, basically today's video is, you know, continue on with the backlogging. The last one was about Smash Brothers, so now this one's about River City Ransom. It's also known as uh, Kaneo Kun over in Japan. It's basically a beat em up slash RPG, uh, things like that. You know, the beat em up part, you know, you're going around from left to right, beating up bad guys, things like that, picking up weapons and bashing their heads in, <laughs> that, that sort of thing. And of course, it has an RPG element, you know, you can go to different shops, you know, eat different foods, and you know, to boost your stats, like your punches, your kicks, you know, that's, you know, that kind of thing. So anyways, uh, the story is basically, you know, your guys, you know, going around beating all these random thugs and trying to rescue your girlfriend at the end, so... That was like the common theme of games back then, you know. The main protagonist got Satan going around saving the girl towards the end. That kind of thing. Whether it's Mario, you know, rescuing Princess Peach. Or uh, Link rescuing Zelda. That kind of thing. So, anyway, um, when this game came out, I mean, I never had a chance to play it, you know. Because my local video store at that time didn't have it to rent. So, I only read about it in magazines and... And of course, later on, picking up the Switch, it was right there available. So, you know what? Hey, let me go try it out for the first time. And you know, pretty much, I'm enjoying it. You know, it's just like playing Double Dragon again. And speaking of Double Dragon, it's made by the same people, uh, Japan Technos. And of course, they are now owned by Arc System Works. You know, the people behind Guilty Gear and Blast Blue series and things like that. So, anyway, all uh, the gameplay, just like Double Dragon, you know, you can punch, kick, jump kick. <laughs> pick up weapons that kind of thing so like I said it's pretty fun you know like once I get the hang of it and things like that and of course like the graphics I mean I'm not worried about the graphics I mean at that time it looked pretty, it looked kind of funny and things like that your characters are kind of squished down you know big old heads small arms and limbs things like that so it's kind of fun you know things like that but anybody who's into these type of games this is definitely for you and then, of course there's like a whole series of games like that and of course, what I came to find out, there's a Double Dragon a Kaneo Kun bundle or River City Ransom here in the States. There's like a bundle coming out on the 20th. So anybody who has a Switch or a PS4, you're in for a treat. So, I mean, of course, it has like a bunch of different games on there, like Double Dragons 1, 2, and 3, plus some of the River City Ransom games, plus like Super Dodgeball. And there's like a, some other games that, you, you know, they were never released outside of Japan, so... Like I said earlier, you're in for a treat and things like that. So it's like, yeah, like I mean, hope you're all enjoying the gameplay. I'd like to hear your opinions about it. Have you played this game before, or do you plan on playing it? Things like that. And like I said, leave your comments down below. This is Sinister. Be easy. It will be easier if you don't resist and less dangerous.